Okay. Hi everyone, I'm John Ennis. This is my wife, Ruth Brown. We're going to do now the 2B recap from week 1, October 2013. Here we're work this whole month we're working on putting hot pops into our basics. So Ruth will now demonstrate the three possible hot pops in a six count basic. Yeah, so um, so we worked on putting the hot pop just in each different little kind of two beat components of the um, of the six count basic. So the normal six count basic is of course rock, step, triple step, triple step. Um, but then we first worked on putting the hop hop in place of the um, the rock step. Uh, so then that was rock, hop hop, triple step, triple step, hop hop, triple step, triple step, hop hop, triple step, triple step. Then we put it in place of the first triple step. So we did a normal rock step, hop hop, and a triple step that looks like this: rock step, hop hop, triple step, rock step, hop hop, triple step, rock step, hop hop. Uh, and then lastly, we worked on putting it into the, um, the uh, second triple step. And that looks like this. Rock, step, triple step, hop, hop. Rock, step, triple step, hop, hop. Rock, step, triple step, hop, hop. Rock, step. Perfect. Yes. So now, so, then we worked on putting it together into our perfect dancing. Yep, and so now we're going to do the send out, send in sequence. But with the hop, hop in place of the rock step, we'll work on putting it in other places next week. So, um, will I just do the leaders things first? Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna, I'm going to send out, send in um, three times. The first time I'm going to put it hop hop in the rock steps, then into the. Oh, let's do it in the hop hops. I'll just do it in the hop hops. Okay, so here we have. So I can go hop hop, triple step, triple step, hop hop, triple step, triple step. So that's me. Now we're going to go. Five. I'm going to go a bit more basic first. A basic first, too. Five, six, seven, eight. So here's the basic. And now she's going to give me a hop, hop. And she goes, can you just go back? Hop, hop. Oh, yeah. So here we go. Hop. When she's out. Hop, hop. Nice. Nice. It's because of the balance, it stays in rhythm. And that's it. So uh, we also talked at one point uh, to make when you're practicing this, uh, you know, in your dancing with your partner, one of the things that we emphasized um, when adding is hop, hop into a rock step. Um, when you're in close position, uh, like for follows especially, you need to maintain so normally a rock step is going to take your um, happens when your leader asks you to move backwards the hop hop needs to respect that same backwards kind of momentum but without you necessarily adding into it you don't want to think about hop hopping backwards because then you're going to pull your uh, your leader off balance so um so think about hop hopping and you know in, under your body um, but respect the fact that if your leader is giving you a rock step you'll naturally um move backwards a little bit. So. Exactly. Same is true for leaders. Yeah. Okay, that's it. We'll see you Thursday. Okay.